Hi guys, it's Pearl and welcome back. I have a Costco haul for you guys t today. Yes, I did go to Costco. So you guys have probably, if you watched my previous hauls, you've heard me speak over and over about Costco and wanting to get to Costco to see what they have. Uh, my husband and I have had a membership for a while now. Um, almost a year, but we've only gone a handful of times, like probably two or three times. Um, <clears throat> I think this is the third time, actually. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I know that some of you might say that's a waste, but we had good intentions when we purchased the membership. Um, so, I went today, and I actually picked up quite a few items and I'm hoping that it will last us uh, for a good while um, maybe e like two three weeks maybe even a month um, some of the stuff so um, I, I actually went and I thought to myself wow why haven't I gone to Costco since we got the membership because they had so many clothing, so much clothing um, for kids and for women and even for men, so brand name, um, non-brand name, but even the brand name and it was really good prices and for the kids they pair the top and the skirt or the shorts um, and, or the, the dress with a capri legging or something like that or a legging. So. Um, you know, for $16.99 or $13.99 or something like that. So, um, I found pretty good deals there. Okay, so we bought <coughs> chicken nuggets. So, I've never tried this before, Harvest Creek. And a lot of these products I have not tried before. So, some of them, like the McCain and the Activia and um, like the Natural Selections, I've tried before. But for the most part, we're talk we I'm trying new things here. Um but they're similar to what we usually buy, so I'm hoping that it'll be good. Okay, so I bought chicken nuggets. Okay, McCain straight cup fries. This is a really huge bag. I think it was five ninety nine four kilograms or eight eight point eight two pounds, so really good buy. Um Activia, so there's twenty four in here. Um, cheese pizza <clears throat> and if you guys want to know any of uh, the prices for any of this stuff just let me know down in the comment box below and I will answer your question okay I just want to go quickly though so I'm not going to you know blur out prices but if you do want to know a price for a specific item just like I said let me know okay so chicken drumsticks um, I thought this was a great deal. It's not organic, but it's fourteen dollars, and for this whole thing, um, I think it's like two point six kilograms. So I don't know what that is in pounds. I think it's like four or five five pounds or something like that. So pretty good price. Oven roasted chicken breast for my husband's sandwiches. Um, and then I found these um, deli cheeses and it said it was natural cheese so I'm assuming that means not processed and my son really likes the you know uh, actually I should say he doesn't like the processed cheese I don't know what it is maybe it's too soft or the taste of it I don't know but he prefer the regular cheese and really in all honesty it is more healthier for you so they have um, in here uh, pepper jack, so it's all kinds of different peppers in there. Then the marble cheddar, uh, this is Swiss, and mild cheddar. So these are all cheeses that we love. So I went ahead and purchased that. And while well, they're kind of like narrow, so my husband would probably have to put two in his sandwiches or my kids. So that's that. Okay, then I brought milk, so 1% seal test and the 3.25 seal test for my kids. Okay, then I bought, um, these are like those, what do you call them? They're multi-grain thin sandwich buns. I don't know if you can see that. So I bought these as an alternative to the, the regular buns. I wanted to try these. Okay, um, ancient grain Dempster bread. Okay, so there's three inside. I think it was six 
99 or something like that. And I bought some cranberry juice. This is the Kirkland brand. I've never tried a different brand other than Ocean Spray Cocktail. So we're going to try this one. And if it works out, this is going to be our new go-to cranberry juice. Okay, post um, Honey Bunches of Oats. So I love this because it's got the... And my kids love it too. So it's got the almonds and then the... Um, what do you call them? Crispy flakes and, and then the oat clusters. So granola crusters. Okay, then I I saw this maple syrup, and in Canada here, we get maple syrup only a certain time of the year. So basically from the middle of March to maybe April. So I was, um, I was really happy to see this. It's now the middle of May, and they still had maple syrup, and it was actually a really good price. It was $11.99. So I know I am telling you guys some of the prices, but... You know, whichever ones stand out to me, I'll, I'll let you know. So this is with one liter. So, <coughs> excuse me, I think we buy the PC one. There is one at PC where... Okay, sorry about that, guys. That was a call center. Um, okay, so maple syrup. Um, yeah, so PC brand I usually buy, but I think it's not one liter. It's less. And plus, I don't like the spout on the PC one. So hopefully this one it has, you know, a better spout. It says it has a better spout. Okay, then um, organic honey. I've never tried organic honey, so we're going to try it. Um, and it actually was the same price, I believe. Actually, no, it was cheaper than the regular uh, Billy Bee honey that we usually buy. So um, this was $6.99 for one kg. Okay, so really good buy. Um, but we're going to try it out and see if we like it. I'm never, like I said, I don't know what the taste is or whatever, so we're going to try it out. Then I bought these popcorn, um, like, chips sort of thing. Um, so in the store, the lady was giving samples of these, um, and it tasted really good. So it kind of tasted a little bit like rice cake, but thinner. So we're going to try that. And, you know, my kids like popcorn, so hopefully they'll take to that as a snack. And they're also the kettle uh, thing. And they're also gluten-free, so I forgot to mention that, guys. Okay, and then the next one is um, Spudniks kettle chips. And these are just barbecue um, kettle chips. Um, they have a smoky taste and sweet, so it's like a barbecue flavor. Um, I taste, this also was in the store, this is a new product they brought in. And they were giving samples and I, I, I loved it. It tasted really good, just like um, Mrs. Vick's kettle chips. It kind of, it tasted just like that. And it's also gluten free. Sorry guys, I'm blanking out because I'm so tired <laughs> from um, Costco shopping. Um, yeah, and then this is also a Canadian company. So you're supporting, if you guys are in Canada, you're supporting the Canadians. Okay, and these are $5.99 each. So brand new product. Okay guys, I'm going to get the other stuff on here and then I'm going to show you the rest of the stuff. Okay guys, so I'm back and um, I have the rest of the stuff here on the table. I didn't get a chance to put away the other stuff, so you will see um, like the milk still on the table. But I bought these Contigo water bottles for my kids. So um, for my two daughters, the pink and purple, and then for my son, the blue one. And uh, it's got, the reason why I bought this is it was a good price. It was 23 uh, no. 22 something so about 23 dollars so it worked out to be seven something per bottle which is really good price especially for the contigo brand now i also like it because it has a spout so if you guys want me to do a review of this product i i can do that um in another video i just don't want to make this video too long but let me know down in the comment box if you want to see me just I guess review it and um, give you my opinion on it. Um, but basically it has a spout and no straw, which I like. Because I I don't know about you guys, but I find it so hard to keep those straws clean. Okay, then I bought this Swiffer wet um, 
cloths because I have a Swiffer mop. And I just like this because it's really quick and easy to mop up the floors. And you can use it, I can use it on my hardwood or the um, tiles, and it works just great. And I bought some Princess um, rubber gloves or latex gloves for cleaning and washing dishes and that kind of stuff. And there's 12 pairs in here, and it actually, this is the brand that I usually buy at the Dollarama and they had it here at Costco so I went ahead and bought it. It works out to be about the same price so I usually pay $1.25 at Dollarama. It works out to be about the same price. It's I think it's slightly less. Um, so like I said if you guys want to know the price of it, the exact price, let me know in the comment box. Um, okay, bananas. Oh, actually, I should probably finish up with these cleaning supplies. And then I bought some Finish Jet Dry. I didn't need the dishwasher tabs because I did buy some recently at Walmart. So, but they did have it for a good, great price at Costco, the one that I use. So I will be um, going back when these ones are done. I will go back. So probably in another month and a half or so. Okay, so the Finish Jet Dry... Rinse agent, okay, bananas, Del Monte bananas, and then strawberries. These are $4.99. I believe they're two pounds, something like that. It's 907 grams, so yeah, about two pounds. I've tasted them actually, guys, and they are so super sweet. Okay, guys, so that's it for the grocery haul. So what I think I might do, just so I don't make this video too long, is I'm going to do the clothing and the household items in a separate video. So look for that coming soon. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching. If you stuck with me to the end, I really appreciate it. I hope that I've given you some ideas. Like I said, let me know in the comment box if you have any questions. This is Pearl saying goodbye. Please don't forget to subscribe.